Hey, what's going on, everybody? Liam Like Potatoes here, and we're getting all, and we're already getting on with another video. I just uploaded part six. Yes, I know there's no part five. I'm sorry. Look, it got messed up. It, nothing all that important really happened anyway. I mean, I only spent like three hours editing that. Not a big deal. No, not at all. Not at all. Just completely fine. You don't have problem. You know, problem. Yes, we're fine. We're not mental. We're not mentally deranged. Well, anyway. Oh my gosh. Oh, we need to go to Skull Lake, which is definitely a symbol of death. Yeah, and also we're going we're going to complete that side quest because it's an important side quest. Don't judge me. Akala. Akala. This is Akala. And Yo! once again, another really suspicious tree. We can't be suspicious of you. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Why? There's most. Oh my gosh! I hate it when they do that! Oh my. Really? Oh crap. That's not good. And they have tree branch now. Oh, I'm so. I'm so scared of tree branch. Okay. Really? Oh my. Oh, whatever. Well, I suppose we'll just have to mark this as a Korok that we messed up. Look at that, ancient gear. Another one, and. Okay. That's far. Not that far. Oh, really? Thanks for the info. Who could have guessed that there was a shrine nearby? Look at that, Korok number, uh, I have a total of 26. Oh, hey, is this a memory or something? I don't know. I've seemed to think that many times. Hey, look, there's just a person standing here. I don't like this. Is it? Oh. Uh. Dumb belly. A dumb belly? Uh, you filth! You have no appreciation of true belly. <laughs> I mean, beauty. I will take your life. <laughs> what is this? What is this? There. Yiga Foot Soldier. And now let me take a picture of these bananas. Can we take a picture of Ricky? No. Zap shroom. Katosa Og Shrine. Get a horse. Katosa Og Apparatus. Oh, we get an apparition. Oh, I don't like this.
Well, okay. Really, you have to do it just perfectly? Oh. What happened? Come on, that will- that's- There we go! It was so difficult! Wow. Unfair. Sweet. We don't need to eat, Avery. Oh, yeah. We're about to get healed. Ooh. Hey! Your shrine sucks. It's too easy. This isn't a test. No issues to report. Good morning! I've been on patrol duty lately. The name's Hawes. Jeans, it's gotten dangerous around here lately. It has. Oh. Yes. Um, recently, I've been hearing about a, sp a suspicious guy named Kilton. What a convenience. This is a very convenient episode, I gotta say. Yeah. He runs a shop called Fang and Bone. They say he goes around pushing some kind of cart night after night. He's been making people around here uncomfortable with his suspicious and, and otherworldly activity. I don't know him. Well, if you see any suspicious people, please tell me what they look like in detail. Pl really, if you see this Kilton character, please tell me all the juicy details. I'm counting on you. I think he wants a picture, doesn't he? He wants a picture. Also, yeah. Oh, this is just the thing about shooting stars. Or fruit, three pieces of fruit or meat. A sacred article. Oh. Good morning. I haven't seen you around here. Boy, you sure have strange taste. You look like someone who has traveled willy nilly all over the world. Who are you? Sorry, I haven't introduced <laughs> myself. I'm Nobo. These people have really dumb names. I've traveled everywhere, but at the end of the day, I like a call it best of all. That's why I'm pretty familiar with stuff around here. Is there something you want to know? This area? Uh, spring of power offer the sacred article to the spring of power that's what it says farther areas ooh shrine quest hey beetle uh oh oh here hi hi huh could that be that's an energetic right I know beetle. That's a rare beetle you almost never see. <coughs> Hasty elixir. Ugh. Hot footed frog. No. Oh. It's like the Maybe I'll sneak into his inventory and replace it with a common beetle while he's not looking. He won't know the difference. No, I'll hire someone to do it for me. No need to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, you're still here? I thought you left. Uh, well, let me know if you change your mind. Anyway, back to business. Okay. That's a good de That's actually a good deal. He's gonna sneak in a... Wow! Yeah, I wanna buy that. Oh. Now let me check my beetle to make sure he hasn't freaking taken it. Weirdo. Yep, there it is. Energetic rhino beetle worth three thirty rupees. That's it. Um. Dirty, dirty cheetah. Yep, take yeah. all of the six hundred rupees. Yeah. And here is wow, six hundred thirty oh. rupees. Yeah, and here's 900 rupees. You won't be, you won't be wow. stealing our beetles now, will you, beetles? Yeah, yeah. yeah I hope yeah. not. I 
think we should probably check our inventory after this just in case. Yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> Love is the answer. And, and thievery. Wait I, a minute. This guy unlocked <gasps> Ow! It didn't even hurt you, you. Good. You deserve that, you freak. You little creep. And he's, he's loaded, and he's a freaking thief. <laughs> Got it. Four rubber drumsticks. So easy. I, he said that he was gonna hire someone else to do it. So. Yeah. Ooh, look at this. Ooh. Hey, hey, you. <gasps> Got him. I mean, oh, oh, how does this guy get around? Here? I like the decor. Nice decoration. What? Did it work? Did it work or did it not work? Or? My what? Oh yeah, that would probably be a good idea. Put on some better gear. And now he has zero. I don't understand what happened the first time because I didn't lose it. My Daruk's protection, so. I don't know what happened. Some sort of glitch, I guess. Yeah, some sort of glitch. Where's that? Where's that guy going? Also, what the heck? No wonder that guardian was there. Yeah. A call it ancient tech. La Are you serious? I have to do this again? Yeah. He's just okay. What the heck? What is going on? Everything you own and everything you've been researching, we don't care. It's ours now. Because. Oh, hey, it's Robbie. Hey, uh. Uh, hello, strange robot. Okay, you're creepy. I, it's, and it's. Hey, you, what are you doing here? Hmm. Hmm? Mm. Um, hi. Uh, creepy. Okay. When you don't focus on him, his eyes just kind of go wonky. That's creepy. Are you the one called Link? Yes. Hmm? Hmm, that's too bad. If you were the legendary Link, there would be something important I need to tell you. But how can I determine with full certainty whether you are not whether or not you are the true hero. Yes, how indeed, hmm? Hmm, yes. If you can show me the wounds your body suffered 100 years ago, that should prove you are truly Link. But he wants me to take off, he basically wants me to strip and show him myself. Here, you creep, mm-hmm, yes. Very sexy. Most seem to have here, but they do line up with the scars I know you got during the Great Calamity a hundred years ago. Yes, I'm the real Link. Can I put on some pants now? No, Dr. Robbie! <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what? What was that? Pura. I met a child. I met a child. Hmm? Pura? Ooh. A child? What, she really has a kid? Or do you mean... Pura aged backward, and she's now child. Pura got younger. Hmm? Are you certain? Hmm, so she's as crazy as ever. <laughs> Okie doke. Knowing her, I'm guessing she screwed up some experiment. Hmm, hmm, yes, typical. Let us return to the subject at hand. <laughs> Whatever, he, you're Did just you? as weird. Yeah. Tell me. Wait, what? Oh, no. Oh, crap. Uh... <laughs> Yes, that's correct! Oh, wait, what? I wasn't paying attention. On that note, uh, sorry for that long preamble, but I'd like to provide you with some ancient soldier gear. Did you catch all that? 
Cheerio, um, the ancient oven, <laughs> creates ancient soldier gear, but I'm afraid she's out of sorts at the moment. I'm afraid someone will have to bring the blue flame from the ancient furnace again. 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 Yeah. And also, I have to... Yeah. Well, time for a torch. Hooray. Oh, and it's going to start raining. If it rains, if it suddenly glitches and starts raining, I will be extremely angry. Here. Now light the flame. Light the flame on fire. Light the fire. I'm on fire right now. Can we please stop this? Finally. Oh ho! You Link, listen. Hmm? My darling Cherry is back to normal. Such is the power of love. My love made Cherry well again. The furnace is lit. The furnace is lit. Oh, uh, well, thank you. Yes, quite. Now then, please take this as a gra as a gift of my gratitude now that Cherry is fixed. Three ancient arrows. They are made using se ancient secret check ah, secret Sheikah technology. With the addition of my upgrades, they have formed into anti-calamity weapons, so to speak. Needless to say, they are an incredibly powerful type of ancient soldier gear. I like to call them ancient arrows. In order, in addition to ancient arrows, Cherry can make all kinds of ancient soldier gear. If you're looking to acquire some, give your ancient materials and rupees to cherry. <sighs> ah, forgive me, Link. Ever since the fall of Hyrule Castle, we haven't had much in the way of funds for our research. That's why I thought you might be willing to help us out with rupees, lots of them. I beg of you. Conquer the calamity! Fine. Hey, hey, familiar, familiar name missing. Whoa, these things are crazy, but they also require some stuff that is really hard to come by. I just want this stuff. Oh my gosh. I'm good. Um, what? I, I'm not sure why. Wait, it's already the Sheikah Sensor Plus, so what's happening? Uh, guys, I'm, I'm confused. Everyone, I'm... What's going on? As far as I know, I just talked to the guy, and um, he said something about we can find the memories using the Sheikah Sensor, and uh, now we're dripping more creepy Sheikah water on my Sheikah Slate. What? What did that do? Okay, what did that do? Avery, stop bouncing that. I told you that last episode. Um. Oh, wow, this is... It recovered a picture from the past! Great. Oh, so you can actually pay him, you can actually pay them to add new things, to, to add things that you haven't gotten to the compendium. Cool. Now that I like. Ah. 
though. Each cost a hundred picture? A hundred rupees? I'd like all of them. Oh. I wish I had known that that wasn't what, it, that that was what it was. Yeah. Clearly I thought they were all just treasure chests, but no, it actually turns out that, oh, really? Oh my gosh. I honestly feel kind of dumb now. Cannot delete data. Okay. So apparently you can't target things with the those with the chica that's what i heard uh, uh, eh? as far as i know that's what they said so also guys i know where one of the memories is and i know i'm getting way off track here and all but i just really want to get these memories done with because i want to unlock the true ending of the game you guys so guys the quickest way to get to this memory is to start near this fairy fountain you just gotta you just gotta walk right past it okay why are there no fairies seriously what's up with that i need to restock Oh look, you can see Varuda. Yeah. <laughs> if you guys remember, this is where we fought our, the first Yiga dude. The, the Yiga. The Yiga boy. The first one. <laughs> okay, do we do you understand now? I mean we've said it like in a hundred different ways, so. Yes? Good. Restless Cricket. For a reason. Is, wait, is he back? He's back. I think he's... B Guys, I think he's back. About a... Or maybe not. About a year ago... When I, I was walking along the road here at night when I suddenly saw a blinding light in the sky. Why is he called Traveler? I think that's when you know you got a Yiga. When my eyes finally adjusted, I found myself looking at a shimmering object floating overhead. I couldn't look away. The next thing I knew, I was bathed in light. When I came to, I woke up in a bed covered in sweat. What do you think about that? It sounds like a dream. At first, I thought it was just a bad dream. But the bed I woke up in wasn't my bed. It was a bed full of liquid in an empty room, and when I looked in the corner, there was a weird glowing device. And when I touched the device, what do you think about that? Oh. Oh, that was cre- Yes! Okay, yep, they can be found in similar places. Oh, oh, that was just dumb. Oh, what the? Thank you for the vicious sickle. Okay, as I was saying, it's one of the memories is here, but it's not on this side. It's actually on the other side. So, Lenaru. Yep, here it is! Here it is, everyone! The memory! Oh, I love these things. 
Here it is. You guys saw it. You guys are see you guys are seeing it. You guys know what's going to happen. Told you. Now we just have to wait. There it is. Three, two, bam. Look at that. We're all here. Oh, oh. oh my. Even the people I don't even know about yet. Those two, I suppose those two other two are the other champions. Well, don't keep us in suspense. How'd everything go up there on the mountain? What? What's going on? So you didn't feel anything? No power at all? I'm sorry, no. Then let's move on. You've done all you could. Wow. Feeling sorry for yourself won't be of any help. After all, it's not like your last shot was up there on Mount Maneiro. Anything could finally spark the power to seal Ganon away. We just have to keep looking for that thing. Yeah. That's kind of you. Thank you. If I may. I thought you, well, I'm not sure how to put this into words. I'm actually quite embarrassed to say it. But I was thinking about what I do when I'm healing. You know, what usually goes through my mind. What? It helps when I think, when I think about. <laughs> what is going on? Oh my! Oh crap. This is bad. Well, it was bad. This is a memory after all. But look at that. This is it, then. Are you sure? Positive. It's awake. Karen. Whoa! Let's stop wasting time. We're gonna need everything we got to take that thing down. Now, champions, to your divine beasts. Show that swirling swine who's boss. Link will need to meet dead and head on when we attack. This needs to be a unified assault. Little guy. You get to Hyrule Castle. You can count on us for support, but it's up to you to pound Ganon into oblivion. No pressure! Come, we should go. We need to get you someplace safe. No. I'm not a child anymore. I may not be much use on the battlefield, but there must. There must be something I can do to help. Don't just stand there. So that's it then. The memory of when Ganon finally attacked. Oh, and is that a... That's a, that's a Lionel! There's that... There are... Just a Lionel for some reason? Hey! Hey! You see that? All we need to do is head for that shrine and we'll be near Kilton. He's this weirdo monster enthusiast who, um, who is, a uh, who likes to, who's enthusiastic about monsters. Also, does anyone else see that weird hole in the ground? It's very, well, obviously you wouldn't be able to see it from around here, but up here there's a, like a weird hole. Either that or it's just the trick of the light. What 
the heck? Oh, yeah, it was this. Ah. It must be a Korok. <gasps> How did I not see that? Another Lionel? That's a blue Lionel. Yeah, a blue Lionel. I've never seen one of those. I forget killed him. A blue maned Lionel. Imagine that. I'm gonna need to heal. And save. Hello, good sir. Hey. Wow. They're all dumb. Oops, uh, I just realized I had that equipped. Oh! oh my gosh, that was I'm telling you. When I say I tried it, I freaking tried it. Also, do you hear a um one of those uh one-eyed guys? How have I forgotten? Guys, look, Korok! Also, I hear Hinox. Guys. Oh. It's because there's a Hinox. Okay, I'm finding so many bosses around here. It's ridiculous. How do you know? Um, well, how about we see? No, Avery. I mean, how about if we, how about we check? Oh. Look, look at this. This is Kilton. Not terrifying. Oh my gosh, he looks freaky. Oh, he, he's even worse. He's worse now. Yeah, he's even worse. Hmm? Oh, it's just a Hylian. Who are you? Me? My name's Kilton. I suppose you're here because you heard I was opening a monster shop and you wanted to see it for yourself. Yes, I'm opening a monster shop called Fang and Bone, but I'm still preparing for my grand opening. Here's my business card. I'm going to need that card back. It's the only one I have. I like monsters. Uh, I adore killing them. I love monsters more than you do. I, uh, sorry, I did it again. I just love the field of monster research so much that I decided to open a shop all about monsters. I call it Fang and Bone. I know. You sit. I travel all around Hyrule in search of rare and exciting monster parts, but I'm not sure where I should visit next. Kakariko Village or Hateno? The Rito Village, Rito Village and Zora are also good options. Hmm. Suppose I could go all the way to Gerudo Town or Lurum Village, but Lake Akala is much closer. I'm so excited I can hardly contain myself. I can't just sit around while there are monsters to be studied. I'm off. I'm sure we'll meet again in some village at night. Fare thee well. You can find him, um, hey. Hmm? Yes. I have information on him. <sighs> yes. How very strange indeed. Ooh. Seriously, I can't thank you enough. This will surely help me hunt him down. Really, I must thank you somehow. 100 rupees. Well, I must return to my mission. Perhaps we're not as safe as we thought. But... There! Yes, there he is! At that one place! Like, just kind of there. And... A much better sword. Yeah, that's just a, that does six damage. There he is. Kilt 
Captain, my boy. The Mr. And creepy music alert. <laughs> yes, oh it's it's me again. It's all, it's now open for business. Our first order of business will be converting your monster parts to mon. What is that? It's a currency I've invented to, to, sta to destabilize the market and fight the establishment. Uh. Just kidding. There's no establishment in Hyrule. I just love monsters so much that I turn them into money. Here's the deal. If you bring me monster parts, I'll exchange them for mon. I'm the only business in Hyrule that accepts this as payment. Pretty exclusive, eh? Anyway, you can spend your mon on various types of monster gear I've created based on my research. Mm. Ah, another thing. I'm always developing new monster gear, so remember to check back in between your adventures. Let's exchange your monster parts for mon. <laughs> Here you go. You don't want any of that? Uh, wow. Uh, that's worth three, that's worth five, that's worth ten. Yeah. Well, let's exchange the whole lot. Yeah, Moblin Fang. Mm. Wait, no, not all of them. Mm. Just a whole bunch. Here, take like 30. <laughs> But I've developed a new piece of monster gear. I call it the Lizolfos masks. Okay, yep, uh huh. You can buy monster extract, uh, a wooden mop, that's garbage. Spring loaded hammer. This strange hammer is one of Kilton's specialties. Being struck with it doesn't hurt all that much. But the fourth swing in a string of attacks will send the victim flying. Whoa, look at this. Um. Odd. Very. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. You can actually equip this stuff to blend in with the enemy. Sure. <laughs> you never know when I'll need to look like a Bacoblin. Uh, great, I just have... Oh look, and look, I can e I even look like a Bacoblin. I'm so cute, I'm so cute. Look at me, look at me. Look at me! I am ado- I am adorable! I can't believe that there was a path leading to it this whole time, but... Yeah. Wait, what? A fairy fountain? No, it's just some rocks that look like I think you can look up all the fairy fountain locations in that book. Um, Avery. <sighs> Guys, here it is. The, the pathway leading into the Korok forest. I hope this actually works. Of course! Of course this would happen. Yep. Let's go to that torch. Lost Woods. I wonder why they call it that. Did anyone hear the tuba? Look at this. I knew it was a good idea to bring that torch along. 
Okay, I know what I'm doing. You gotta follow the embers fo going off the flame. Very directly. Oh, yeah, and also, yeah. The flames will also help. Yeah. And there's also these lights here. Well, not like. Also, the trees have creepy faces. Really? Yeah, that's not disturbing. At all. Well, we continue onward. You see it. Oh! That tree just popped out of nowhere. Okay. Yeah, it's a scary tree. Yeah. Oh. Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. Okay. Okay. Look at this. Wait, which way? Okay. This way. Stop, stop. Yes, it still wants us to go that way. Still go this way. Oh, the trees are getting so creepy. Okay, continue to go this way. We're just heading toward Rito. Yeah, that is true. The game really wants seems to want me to go to Rito Village. Okay. Never mind, we're going to the Um. We're heading for Mito Swamp, apparently. Ah, uh, Mito Swamp, I think. Apparently there's a shrine nearby. That's a good sign, Liam. Okay. Because there's a um, shrine in the Korok Village. Forest. Forest. It's this way. I expect that it is this way. Oh, yeah. we, we passed the test with... Let's hope so. Hope so, Liam. It looks like we still have to go this way. Wait. What the heck? Into the creepy mist. Really? Yeah. Really? Get rid of the creepy mist and you're just left with the forest. It looks much less threatening now. The Korok Forest. It has Koroks and a rock. Hello, people of the Korok Forest. I come in peace. <gasps> is that the sword? It's the master sword! Guys, it's the master sword. Is it unbreakable? Of course it's unbreakable. Master sword. All its glory. The sword that seals the darkness. And guys, look, there's a giant tree up here. And it's here. Very well, let's try and pull this. 
What the heck? Link. <gasps> you are our final hope. What the heck? The fate of Hyrule. With Oops. You. Oops, sorry. Oh my gosh. Sorry. That ruined a critical moment, Leon. Sorry. Oh my. <sighs> <sighs> Who is that? Did I doze off again? Uh, yeah. Hmm. Well, well. It's you. Yes, it's me. You finally decided to return. Oh, what's that supposed to mean? Better late than never. After 100 years, I'd nearly given up hope on seeing you again. You were asleep. Even my It's a talking tree! Lips, you know. It's a talking tree! At least it's not creepy. That look on your face tells me that you have no recollection of me, however. I have watched over Hyrule since time immemorial. Whoa. Many have referred to me over the ages as the Deku Tree. Uh-huh. That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. The sword that seals the darkness that only the chosen knight can wield against the Calamity Ganon. Whoa. Believe it or not, it was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. What's behind the Korok's mask? But I must warn you to take extreme caution. The sword stands as a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. Seems not reassuring. As you are now, I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. If you sought to free the sword in any sort of weakened state, you would surely lose your life where you stand. By that he means you need to have 13 hearts or more. Best of luck, young one. So yeah. We're not pulling up that sword anytime soon. Link, don't you dare grab a hold of it. If you hope to pull the sword from its resting place. You must use your true strength. Let us see whether you, or not you currently possess that said power. Ooh. Uh, no. Oh, Mr. Hero. Hey, are you the hero? Could it be? Welcome to Korok Forest. You're much cooler looking than I thought you'd be, but to be sure you're up to the task at hand, I prepared a trial for you. What do you think? Will you accept my trial? I'll do it. Hooray! Show me a rod with the power of ice, please. Yahoo. Yep, I've ro located an ice rod. Equip it. There we go. Shimmering, sparkling, what a sight to behold. Thank you. Mr. Hero, your weapon is so amazingly, wonderfully sparkly. I must give you something as thanks. A hundred rupees. Whoa. I just got a side quest and then um, just as quickly completed that side quest. All in one, comfort, all in one conversation. We will destroy all your pots because... Look at this! Yeah. No! Vegetarians everywhere! Stop! That's my face! Yeah. Ah! Sorry about that. I must have dozed off for a bit. Oh! Oh! You're Mr. Hero, aren't you? The great Deku Tree told me all about you. So you made it to our forest, huh? I've been waiting so long, I thought I might start to put down roots. <laughs> Welcome to the great Deku Tree's navel! I made a bed out of leaves just for you, hero. Take as long as you'd like with the zoo. Oh, I don't want your rupees. You're the great Mr. Hero. I pre prepared this bed for you ages ago. All I want is for you to get some sleep. Yeah. Until morning. Until I say good morning. 
Good morning, you can grab some breakfast next door at the spore store. Oh, glowy hoppy. It's, 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 it's Mr. Hero. Yay, Mr. Hero came to visit us in the forest. What took you so long? Peaks thought a trial, thought of a trial that would make a, make Mr. Hero stronger. You won't have to fight. It's not that scary, but you'll need to be extra careful. So I want to see a bloopy. It's a glow blue hoppy thing that glows in the dark. Just about peak size. I really want to see a bloopy. Even if it's just a picture of one. Th this guy seems to want my rupees. Give me the hearty truffle. Yeah. Okay, so here. Sniff, sniff, you smell nice, Mr. Hero. I'm so happy. You smell nice even after a hundred years. Oh, look at that, a hearty radish. <laughs> Um, really? No. I'll take all of them. It's disturbing. Okay. Also, where's the goddess statue in this? What do you want? Oh, complete the trials. Oh, you, could it be? You're Mr. Hero, Mr. Hero is here. The mushroom on my head suddenly sprouted today, so I knew something was up. It was a prediction that you'd come, I think. Us Koroks all got together and prepared some trials for you, Mr. Hero. If you trash the very tough trials we prepared, pulling out the master sword will be a piece of cake, probably. Among the trials is, the, is an extra tough one designed by me, the elder of the Korok Forest. So will you test your metal in the Korok trials? Korok trials? Long story short, you need to visit all the shrines in the Korok Forest so you can be considered a real grown-up. What? It's a ceremony that every Korok must undertake and it's based on the trials of the legendary hero himself. I've done it, so it's Hestu, and him over there, and her too. Even the great Deku Tree himself uh, has done it. Okay, that last part was a lie. He's pretty rooted. Trial 1 in the Southwest Forest, Trial of Second Sight. Trial 2 in the Northwest Forest, the Lost Pilgrimage. Trial 3 in the Eastern Forest, the Test of Wood. If you can overcome these, you can overcome anything. We've also prepared some wonderful prizes. I'll do it. The Korok Trials. Oh, look, it's Hestu. I don't know how I didn't notice. I must have. Apparently, there's one around here. Oh, found it. Look at that. We've got ourselves another shrine right here. Okay, as I said, there is a specific place. I Wait, what did I say? Look to the sky constellations are the what look to the oh those look to the stars for guidance okay so i figured it out so look here it's two down and uh, it's right here then it's the one in the bottom left corner. But for over here, you have it so that, you gotta have it so that the first one, it's right here. And the second one, it's right here. Look at that. So
So, you want to remove all of all of the balls? Okay, for the left one, the next is on the... He, the first one goes here, and the second one goes just above the bottom left corner this time. Then, you will want to have it so that this one... You basically want to make these ones opposite to what they were before. No. And there, you get a chest. You get a nice claymore. That's pretty good. Why did you drop something? Oh, wait. Didn't it say my inventory was full? Oh, I thought it said my inventory was full. Uh, that's just what you expect. Yeah, I just thought it, that it said my inventory was full. It, it makes me think that every time I open a chest, it's going to say that. Your inventory's full. Wee! Your inventory's full. Your inventory's full. Wow. Guys, just a sec. I want you to check this out. Look, you hold out your shield. You press X, then you press A. You can shield surf, but if you do it quickly enough, you can get on and then instantly flip off. Look at that! Slow, slow motion replay. It's just a Korok. Don't worry, everyone. Yeah! I have enough for another slot in my inventory. Okay, come on. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. That's it? That's all you got? Yeah. What is behind the map? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Hey! Don't try any funny business, Wind. Or any more funny business, because you just tried some funny business. And, uh, Whoa. I haven't seen some... I haven't seen a place... So wide o open with nothing there except for just patches of trees. It looks nice. I like this. Yeah. Too boring. <gasps> of course, of course they had to have something like this. Of course, whenever there's a wide open area, you can't expect for tranquility. Yes! You just gotta shoot it! Yeah. It, it has a distinct smell. Yeah. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this! There's a dragon! Didn't roll! Let's wait until it gets all the way into view. Oh my goodness. Yeah. It's beautiful. Also, I just want to look at this thing in the album. I mean, the compendium. Uh, let's see here. Uh, it's a monster? A spirit of fire has taken the form of this giant dragon, making its home in the Elden region. It's said to have served the spring of power since ancient times, since... An old saying goes, the dragon ascends to the heavens as the sun begins to set, but nobody has witnessed this in the current age. The flames that coat 
its body make it dangerous to get near, but Dinral bears no ill will toward people. Whoa. Anyway, I have the shrine. I, I saw it. I don't know what's called. Um, it will probably inform me. No, it, it won't. Um, I don't know. Drawing parabolas. What? Oh, I'm flying now. Whee! What does this do? Oh. There! That's how you get the chest. And a thunder blade, which is better than my lightning rod. Whoa. Whoa, boy, look at that. Oh, I just got smacked in the face. Look at me. Look at Link. His blank expression. It's like... It's like he's in pain. Wait. It didn't say that this had opened up. Oh, wait, it did. But here it is. Another spirit orb. We have six now. And uh, as far as I know, nowhere to put them. I've somehow been spotted. Also, there's a shrine nearby, apparently. <gasps> Whoa, he just destroyed that box. Uh. Wow. Dragon Bone Boko Spear. That must be good. Twelve. Oh. oh! Only a heart and a half. Topples to the ground, dead. Like, dead. Oh my gosh.
wow, this is really, really easy. Go. Oh, there it is. Wow. There's like nothing. All the enemies are just really pathetic. There. Okay, okay. Difficulty level off the charts. Rupee? I was just expecting some kind of crap. And shock arrows? Whoa. To them? They're being attacked by bees. Oh, come on. I have to ditch the bu- <sighs> Oh man. Jeez, I wonder why it gets difficult. Wow. Topaz. That's what I get. Okay, well, um, guys, we've accomplished a lot. I didn't to do we didn't get to the Rito place but we did find the Korok forest and the location of the master sword and um what else did we do again uh 
as far as I know, we didn't really do. We got like we got two shrines. Ton of Lionel. Oh uh, yeah, we found a load of Lionels. Maybe I think we found a Hinox. I don't know, but any. Yeah, and we we t we did find that crazy dragon. And we found yeah, and we found Kilton. Those were things that I did not see coming. Hey, who threw the stone? You gonna pay? Why? Oh my gosh, it's crawling back up the mountain. The head is crawling back up the mountain. I think that's a good time as ever to say that's gonna be it for this video. Be sure to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye! It's thunderstorm. I hate that. I hate it when that happens.